Hey guys, it's Jessica, and welcome to another haul swatch lip video. I hope you guys are liking this style of video, because it's what I'm doing for these couple of sets here. But, I'm sure I will get more lip products in the future, because I freaking love lipstick. So, anyway, right now we are going to be swatching the Wet n Wild Mega Last. Um, this is the liquid lip color and I'm really excited to be swatching these. I did wear one so I do have kind of a first impression thought on it. Um, so let's just get started with the swatches shall we? We shall. So this first one is called Rose to the Occasion. Like rose is in like a a color rose. I need to move that out of the way so that the camera can focus on the rose to the occasion. Will you focus on the rose to the occasion? There we go. There we go. Okay, so it's a very nice mauve pink. Um, I feel like this is a pretty natural color, at least so far. Um, and here it is on the hand. You guys can tell. Pretty freaking pigmented. Um, the applicator is a doe foot applicator, but it has kind of a a divot. I don't know if you can see that, but it kind of goes roop. You know, it's it kind of does that. But there it is on the hand. Very, very pretty. Um, I think that this one will dry matte. I'm not entirely sure though, but we will see once it dries. It does take a while for these to dry. That is probably my number one complaint, but this is rose to the occasion, I think. Yep. Alright, the next shade we have is a really pretty color. Um, by the way, Jay helped me pick these out. Um, this one is called Crawl Out of Bed, and it I like it. It's, it's pretty. Um, and here it is swatched. It reminds me of the Kat Von D Adora shade. I love that shade, by the way. Um, I really do like that liquid lipstick. It does remind me of that liquid lipstick, so just letting you know. Um, so there is the color right there. <laughs> and I think it's called Roll Out of Bed. Roll. Crawl. Crawl me bad. Oh! Coral me bad. I cannot see or read worth crap. You guys, that was kind of bad. Okay. So anyway, there's that color right there. <laughs> it's the bottom one. Alright, this next shade is called Do I Make You Blush, which I really like that shade name. I think it's really cute and adorable, and I wish my camera would not focus on my nails. There we go. Do I Make You Blush? And it's just a nice, you know, kind of has a sheen to it. Um, and... Sorry. Okay, and here is the shade. Very pretty. I think I did wear this one. I don't know if it was this one. Pretty sure it was this one, actually. And I will have to say, you guys, I really like this product. I think it's really good for the money. I think uh, you're paying, I think it's like $3 for these. And it's worth it, in my opinion. I think it's almost... In my personal opinion, you guys, keep in mind that this is my personal opinion, but I think it's almost comparable to the Kat Von D ones. I seriously do. I really love the formula of these. They do last a really good amount of time. You do have to reapply, but, um, you know, you only have to reapply, like, in the center, and then the rest is fine. This is actually a pretty good product, and I would recommend it just based off of first impressions. So if you want to see, like, a whole review after I've tested them more, <laughs> then I will surely let you know. Alright, so here is the next shade. This one is called, um, The Roof? Raisin the Roof. Raisin the Roof, like a, you know, oatmeal raisin. I don't like raisins. I mean, I kind of like raisins, but not too much. This is a really pretty color, though. It's like a a uh, raisiny color, like a grape color, and then it has like gold flecks of shimmer in it. It's really, really pretty. I don't know if you guys can really see how pretty it is. Um, maybe in the tube you can. It's so pretty. So anyway, that's called a Raisin the Roof, and yeah. 
The next shade we have here is called Pink Perfection, which is a very nice corally pink shade. And um, I'm excited about this shade, honestly. So there is the shade right there. Just a nice pale peachy pink shade. Very, very beautiful. This is like the perfect shade for my lips, like when I wear a nude shade. This is kind of the shade I go for. So I really like it, personally. <laughs> I, I'm a fan. So here's what it looks like. Hopefully you can see it. There. I don't know. Alright. And then the last shade is this one called Back to Fuchsia. Back to the Fuchsia. You know, like Back to the Future, but Fuchsia. You gotta play Mad Gab a little bit. <laughs> This one is so freaking ba bam pigmented. I mean, look at that. That is just like, what? All right, so one thing I do have to say um, is like it'll dry and it'll be kind of sticky. And basically, it'll feel like a temporary tattoo. Like if I rub this, um, it feels like a tattoo, like a temporary tattoo. So it does have a really, really weird texture to it. And I'm not sure I really appreciate it fully, but. <laughs> You know, it is, you know, it is a cheaper product than those high-end ones, and I do think it does the job, you know, pretty decently. So here I am just going to swipe this, and you can see it does come off. This is a makeup remover wipe, by the way, but I can never remove all of it. I used, I need to use my oil, oil makeup remover, so that kind of tells you how, like, well these really do stay on so I actually um I actually really like that and uh if you can get over the feeling like you have a temporary tattoo on your lips then you like these um they don't dry out the lips they just feel like they do like basically it feels like you have a temporary tattoo on your lip and then once you take it off your lips aren't dry but that's just based off of first impression, like I said. So if you guys want a full in-depth review on these, then please let me know and I can do that for you <laughs> sometime. But see, I can't get these can't get these off. So I am trying really hard not coming off. Not coming off, you guys. So I don't know. Pretty good in my opinion. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this um this hand and lip swatch video. Um, I love you guys so much and as I said if you want to see a full review please let me know in the comments and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.